Greetings. <laughs> Greetings to your mind, big boy. This is a show where we drink our drink and read your spooky ghost stories. We're filming four episodes, all of them being filmed tonight. <laughs> There's a bird. And uh, we're a little different now than when we were at the, uh, at the, at the what do you call it, beginning. Well, uh, as, all, just, as always, we'll be drinking a tasty beverage prepared by our cocktail maestro, Stephen Lim. Who? Oh. That's not spit, baby. That's water. That's called the liquid life, motherfucker. Stevie, what do you got for us tonight? Oh, Jesus I Christ. Fuck, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Stephen, you're still here on this little show, Too Many Spirits? Like, I thought you would have been caught up to the big leagues by now. But this is the big leagues. I, I, I said no to other gigs I had. That was a journey. Okay, welcome now to Steven's Bar. No, shoot, why do I keep messing up? Steve's. Steve's, Steve's Bar, you can <sighs> take a breath, man. You're going to twice. Peekaboo! Oh, oh, <laughs> hey, what's up? You thought I was gonna do a magic trick, but I just treated you like a baby. Peekaboo! <laughs> <laughs> A quarter of a cup of honey. Yeah. So, you know, don't even measure. Just You, you just literally. said <laughs> you should measure man. things. My rules. Oh, right. <laughs> Cinnamon, nutmeg, and cloves, and you know me. <laughs> oh, you're supposed to do this in an electric mixer, but I don't have that. I got hands, and so I'm just gonna go in this guy. Oh, yeah. Cell. Yeah, I like oh, butter. Yeah. I'm gonna throw some hot water on that butter to, you know, get it off. Get oh, off. Oh, damn, dude. This is a uh, hot butter rum. We got hot, we got butter. What else do we need? Rum. I heard you say it at home. <laughs> this is gonna be Ryan and Shane at this point in time. That's what that, we're that's, gonna be like? That's oh. spot on. I looked exactly like us. Ice! We wouldn't even know. We got ice in this drink. No, nope, you're supposed to. <laughs> we also need simple syrup. I prefer, I really do tend to prefer a complicated syrup, personally. Why? Why? It's just a joke. It, it's, it's, it's just a syrup joke. Oh, that was a joke. <laughs> Bartenders usually laugh at people's jokes. Yeah, you want to tip me? No. Hey, here's a tip. Keep your mouth shut, Shane. <laughs> One point five. That's still, that's still, that's still not, of rum. Oh, of rum. Oh, okay. That's right. Gotcha. Did you? Were you gonna call us bitches? <laughs> I think you were gonna call us bitches, dude. <laughs> gotcha, boys. <laughs> oh, holy shit. It. Okay. Oh, that's strong. That's a lot of rum. <laughs> that's a lot. Right. That's a lot of rum. Did you measure that correctly? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. <laughs> Pick up that speed. <sighs> <laughs> Once again, he's not drunk right now. He did not pregame this. I'm lit though. What? Is what does that mean? I'm gonna rim. Don't, don't say you're gonna rim job it. <laughs> the old limb rim. I'm gonna give it the limb job. I'm gonna go <laughs> the old <gasps> limb job. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, is that sh Whoa. Am I shimmying right? Or shimmering. Oh, am I shimmering? Yeah, shimmering. Yeah, shimmering. shimmering. Well, Show shimmy. us those shoes, by the way. Can you get one up here? Oh, okay. okay, okay no, right. you gotta. <laughs> you're showing us the bottoms of the shoe. You gotta yeah, show we us wanna the... see the little jingle bells. The way this is framed looks oh, really like it's like it. a nude shoot where the cups are covering <laughs> your dong. Shh. Oh no. What? I forgot to salt the glass. You forgot <laughs> what? Nothing. What did you do? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Intoxicate my friend. Jesus Christ. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, I missed. You missed the class! <laughs> We're here for the show. So, because I missed, I will punish you by doing double shot. Boom. What? That seems like you should punish yourself. Yeah, why are you punishing us? How did you miss? Oh, no, not the dong <laughs> shot again. There we go. Yeah, like, going super oh. Saiyan. Oh. <laughs> Is that what you're saying like that? Yeah, yeah that's, that's good. good. Oh, oh! Whoa, 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 okay, whoa, wait, whoa. no, no, yeah. <laughs> Magic shake. Oh! oh! I can't even see it. Really adds a lot to that <laughs> optic there. Ta da! <laughs> Next up, we have our lime juice. You know what's funny about lime? What? It's like limb with an E. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> it's pretty good. Yeah. And you know what E is? Ecstasy. Oh. Who's knocking? The juice! <laughs> limb juice! Don't call it don't limb, call juice. limb juice. Don't call it limb juice. drink responsibly, kids. Of course. Of course. Kids, don't drink at all. <laughs> hey! Elf boy, bring me my drink. Okay! <laughs> Ooh. What the fuck? I am the ghost of the hangover, hangover Pass! Pa oh, this is the one from Calf! Oh, I am delivered <sighs> from Calf! Oh, 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 
Jesus Christ. It's recording. It's been a while since I saw you. What was episode one? I'm feeling a little bit more laxed right now. Are you talking to the spirit cam again? I love a shadowy figure. Yeah, you sure do. Uh, what is that supposed to mean? Oh, uh, you love a sh you you like you eyes turn into dinner plate saucer plates. You get real spooked. Your eyes get real wide. You look like a a little scaredy cat when when a thing goes bump or a a thing goes whoosh or something goes creak or. Or someone slightly shifts their weight and you cry like a little baby. Fair. So I'm the child. Now here's me standing in the corner. Okay. I'm asleep. <gasps> Santa? Have you been a good boy this year, little Shane? <laughs> yeah. You sure, little Shaney? I don't like it anymore. Hey, what do you say that that drink has two? Many <gasps> spirits. He fucking got us. It does have too many spirits. It is, it is too many spirits. You know what? Respect. Can we put some cream of coconut in it? Yeah. Okay. Hey, we got it. He's probably just gonna give you more tequila. Cream me, Lim. <laughs> cream me, Stevie. You really want some cream? Cream me, Stevie. Let's get it. Go from real far. Ah, That's so gross. More. Beautiful. Oh, it's on the drink cam too. I <laughs> <laughs> gotta mix it up. I just see it all. <laughs> Just sitting at the bottom. It looks disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't look good. It, I don't taste it at all. <laughs> Mix it up with my finger. Oh, God. Oh, I spilled, <laughs> spilled it off. I cannot bear to watch this. The glass broke. <laughs> oh, no! Are you serious? Yeah, it's in my butt crack. <laughs> <laughs> oh, then Shane pissed himself. <laughs> How did I break that glass with my finger? I must have real strong fingers. How is this possible? It also formed like a perfect hole. It was weird. It's crazy. It was so strange. It was so strange. That was good. Can I get a refill, please? Yep. You only got one more. Ryan, we got more. Oh, thank you, baby. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, baby. <laughs> you know what the fucked up part about that is? I was picturing I was talking to Mari, <laughs> and then I looked up, and I saw Stephen Lynn dressed as an elf, and I was horrified. <laughs> oh, thank you, baby. <laughs> oh, God, delete that footage forever. No, keep it. I'm not going to watch this episode just because of that moment. I thought this was him grinded into a cup, but... It doesn't smell like a douchebag. Oh, you... <laughs> Saddle up, dude. You talking about Spirit dude? Cam, you oh. stupid piece of shit! Hey, man, don't call me fucking shit. Sorry. But you can call me, you can call me stupid. <laughs> this is from Awkward Introverts. One. Got that number one spot, baby. That's, that's, that's big. That's Congrats. Big you get our first grats of the season. <laughs> when I was 11... <laughs> the chair's clean. When I was 11, we had a man living in our loft for over a year. Love the start, okay. Without us knowing. I mean, it would be weird if you knew and you were just like, all right, I guess. Good to see you, lofty. <laughs> we always assumed the noises we would hear were birds. <laughs> Eventually, the police went up and found him with a bed. A laptop. Wait, wait, wait a second. Hold on. <laughs> this guy that they didn't know was living in their loft somehow snuck a, a mattress? A mattress up in? <laughs> He's walking that shit up the stairs like that episode of Friends. Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah, Brad. Right. <laughs> Pepe. <laughs> the police found him with a bed, a laptop, and a microwave up there with him, LMAO. <laughs> 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 they found it with a bed, a laptop, a microwave, and a lava lamp. 
Uh, I love the LMAO. <laughs> you, you imagine walking around your house and being like, you smell hot pockets? Do you hear those birds in the attic again going, beep, beep, beep. <laughs> he apparently would creep around our house during the night for food and was growing, <laughs> and was growing weed in his house next door. <laughs> This guy Hell sounds yeah, like dude. my fucking hero, dude. This guy's, this guy's downing pizza life. bagels on the reg <laughs> while fucking growing some whole, sick, dank weed. <laughs> his whole house is full of that dank, dank. Well, and then he's, he's chowing like, down. He's like, I'm not, gonna, I'm not even gonna live in my house. I'm gonna live in the... <laughs> In the loft of the people next what, door. What do you want me to? You want me to live where I'm growing, bro? Too bad. It's I can't full of that. that plant. <laughs> As I said, not a ghost story. <laughs> <laughs> but it's hard to trust new houses these days. I'm gonna give it 1,000 spirits out of out of 10. You know what I'm gonna give it? 420 spirits. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Most days were calm. I made a rat friend, a rooster friend who got its head bitten off. I ate a burger. Let's backtrack a second. I want to visit the Philippines now. Wait a second, he had a rooster? I made a rat friend, a rooster friend who got its head bitten off. I ate a burger. Those are the three things you must do when you visit the Philippines. I'll bring it. Pineapple! Fuck, I missed. Because you asked for it. <laughs> Open wide. Thank you. What a beautiful world we live in. Yeah. That pineapple exists. Fuck. I'm not a religious man, but I get it. Imagine being the fucking first person to crack open a pineapple, dude. It doesn't look inviting. It's spiky and weird. What do I want with that? And they'd be like, crack it open, mon frere. Hey. Those things we're afraid of? Yeah, these fucking spiky balls with funny hairdos? The tits. Grandpas are funny. Imagine you're a grandpa. You okay. got this grandchild. Well, you know, grandpa, I had people at school tell me I had a doppelganger. A, a doppelganger. Anyway, I, I'm gonna go to the bathroom now. I go okay, to the bathroom. I'm gonna follow you. You'll follow. I gotta follow you for the story. Okay. I, uh, why don't I be the grandpa here since I'm making the point? Because I don't think you're really taking this in the direction. <laughs> cats are fucked up. They're weird. Yeah. They don't belong here. Aren't all cats perpetually anxious? I don't know what their deal is, man. But I don't think they belong on Earth. I agree. Uh, anyway, let's get to the next story. This comes from the first story. <laughs> The first story. Uh, this comes from user first story at boob69420. <laughs> Is that their name? <laughs> Did you make that up? It's very funny. I respect it. <laughs> and now I'm very excited for this story. We got Banshee knocked. Three knocks on the front door, warning of a death in the family. No one died until two years later. <laughs> when when my father passed on the same date. Sad. Uh, that's it? I'm a little lost. I'm not gonna lie. That's the, that's they, they throw you right into it with three knocks. What would you say about three knocks, Ryan? That's demonic. Mocking. <laughs> Someone knocks at your door. No one's there. Yeah. Is that a banshee? I mean, I guess. I, I, I don't know what a banshee looks like. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was a cold February evening in Norway. Oh, nice to go on a little trip. I'm, I'm going to Norway right now. Oh, yeah, dude. Enjoy it. <sighs> oh, my God. <laughs> Around the same time last year, my cousin got married. Congrats. Congrats I got to a your cousin. piece of ice there. We were at his house post-party when we heard a bunch of strange-ass noises from the roof. The well, walls. I thought, you, I thought they were going to say they heard a bunch of strange ass noises from the room. And I was about to say they bang it. There's a difference between strange ass noises and strange ass noises. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? I know what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah. Ain't that like cousins? They're not cousins. They Cousin, ain't cousins. Hey, look, cousins are weird. What are they doing? How come they're not your siblings? What? Why are. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> What, I'm related to these people and their children, but they're not my siblings? Oh, they're my parents, siblings, children? Huh? You know? No, I What's don't know. What's the deal? <laughs> what, the, what the fuck are you talking about? The walls were really thin, so it wasn't worrying. After maybe an hour, the noises began again. Wait. Just... 
Huh? Just imagine, just like you're staying in the house with another couple, and they're just banging so hard that you think your house is haunted. <laughs> After maybe an hour, the noises began again, and this time we heard loud growls. Oh shit! <laughs> I think he just shit his pants. Oh, oh. The real Santa has sent me to punish you all. I'm the real Santa, bitch. When my mom was a kid, she was at her grandmother's funeral. There was usual funeral shit, but important. <laughs> yeah, you know, a body. A casket. Yeah, tears. it was the usual funeral shit. Fucking, fucking tears we and saw flowers. Our fucking body in the casket, and then some priest was like, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> some fucking old ass person in a box. Would you buy a house that? Oh yeah. Would that have a, a whack ass killer that axe murdered their family? I would be hesitant to. I know the market is real saturated. How, right how, now. Uh, how much of a discount would it have to be? Like forty percent. I think you'd go for thirty. Yeah, I would. You're twenty. Right. Yeah, 20. 20, wow. 15? Sure. 10? Yeah. You'd go for a 10% discount for a house that had an axe murder happen I where mean, everyone I don't, was murdered inside. <laughs> I don't know them. But no, what, if you, what, if, what if you got possessed and they made you do that? I don't think that's a thing. And, you, and you, you murdered Sarah and your precious Obi. I wouldn't do that to them. But it wouldn't be you. No, it would be because I don't, I've, <laughs> I've never been possessed. I don't believe in that. It's the first time for everything. 5%? Sure. Okay, no, no discount at all. Yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> There's an apple. I, I, uh, I'm gonna submit my resume to you as well. I'm looking for a new boss. My boss is too mean. Uh, I'll be sweet to you, baby. <laughs> <laughs> One time, me and my friend Nino went to Goatman's Bridge at night. Know it well. You might want to consider calling that by the, the actual name. Shane and Ryan's Bridge. Thank you. And we copied what Shane did. Like the whole speech? I guess, I don't know. This is fairly iconic, so. <laughs> then suddenly we both got chills and felt something near us. We looked around and heard a strange noise that sounded animalistic. After that, we bolted out of there as quickly as possible. It could have just been a raccoon, but to this day, we both firmly believe that we had an encounter with Goatman. He ain't there anymore. We booted his ass. He's gone. <laughs> it's ours now. Yeah. If you heard something there, it was us. And if it sounded animalistic, it's because we were growling. That's true. We told that fucking Zero to go straight back to hell. Pack your bags, buddy. Yeah. The fucking charade's over. He's out of there. This bridge belongs to the boys now. His sorry ass got booted. He's done for. Do you remember, do you remember the noise he made when he had to walk away? <laughs> 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 and you can hear his little click clacking. Yeah. Click clack, click clack. Ooh, why are you so poor? little ass. I never thought I'd have to give this up. His shitty little hooves. Fading into the night. I don't know where he is now, but he's a fucking loser. Yeah, I agree. Here's to, to booting that fucking loser <laughs> right off of his home turf. Hope you enjoy hell, dickhead. Well, then we're... What, did you say something about masturbating? <laughs> I'll say the rhythm is not there. What about this tasty lick? <laughs> Yeah. What about it? <laughs> Let's go to the next question. Yeah, I think we ought to. There's it's not a question. <laughs> it's a ghost story. I'm just getting a little, I get a little confused sometimes. <laughs> father, father, <laughs> make it wet. Don't say Sing that. Sing a song I don't think we haven't that. heard yet. Praise be. Praise, Praise the be. mailbox. Praise the mailbox. Praise the mailbox. Uh, Okay. So long story short, my dead dad as a ghost caused my neighbor's cats to go on anxiety meds. <laughs> my fam and I always joke that my dad used to hang around in that house because hot soccer mom used to live there and just stayed to scare <laughs> cats because he was a wise ass. Funny that it's a family joke. I guess so. <laughs> that funny family joke where dad was checking out the neighbor. LMAO, dad wanted to fuck the neighbor. <laughs> yeah, dude. RIP, dude. Rip to that dad. <laughs> you use your aunt literal Shrek. <laughs> Literal Shrek? Don't Holy get shit. it! That's pretty good. He's no, yeah, Wait, pretty read good. this one as Shrek. I don't think I can do a good one. Yeah, you can. One Hanukkah. No, no. It's not no, gonna you happen. Got it's it. not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. I'm sorry. Go for it. We all go. <laughs> yeah, you got it. Shrek's talking about Hanukkah. One Hanukkah. We all gather to light the menorah. Our cat jumped on the table too close to the candles, and before we knew it, her tail burst into flames. Okay, don't forget about Sweet Shrek. 
because you're doing intense Shrek right now. But don't forget, every now and then it goes like. Okay, no, no, no. What you're doing right now is giving me too much direction. No, now no, I'm no, in no, my no. head. No, now I'm in no, my no, head. No, no, no. You're not and in your I head. I can't get out I of it. I just want you to think, but I'm more than just an ogre. <laughs> My mom once hired a family friend's daughter to help around the house, and she fainted on her first day. <laughs> a lot of dust. That's not it. That's <laughs> it. There's more. Oh, by the way, a little uh, European flair here. My mom, it said. Oh, I like that. I guess I should read it within English. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, please All give right. us a good. My mom once hired a family friend's daughter. To I help can't even understand. To <laughs> help around the you house. You gotta dial it back. Dial okay. the main down to like five. My mom once hired a family friend's daughter to help around the house and she fainted on her first day. We were told to take her straight back to her family, no hospital. Upon arrival, they had a religious figure and the whole neighborhood at the ready on either side of a cot. <laughs> it sounds like actually like personal. <laughs> it sounds like a fucking cult. I thought I was, <laughs> I thought I was gonna die <laughs> because when she woke up, she spoke, <laughs> she spoke in a completely different voice. <laughs> and started thrashing against the neighbors, holding her down. Turns out she's the type of person who's especially susceptible to spirits. So getting possessed was a common occurrence. You think she woke up and started speaking like Stitch? Just like, Mommy, are you awake? Hey, how's it going, everybody? <laughs> <laughs> You've never written a novella about killing somebody? No. Have you? You have, haven't you? You've written dozens. Hours and hours of you imagining a murder in detail. Yeah, it, but, but it wasn't for like a partner. It was for like more like a, like a work partner, like a- Oh, interesting. Stephen one, Lim? One could even say like a work husband. Stephen Lim? No, not Stephen Lim. Matt Rial? No, not Matt Rial. Huh. I was just funny. remembering some of, some of it. That sounds fun. It's fun. That sounds funny. Yeah, it's, it, it could be. One Christmas, my grandfather surprised my grandma with tickets for an Alaskan cruise. Oh shit. Old people love cruises. And she said he wasted his <laughs> <laughs> She said he wasted his money and then tore them up. Oh <laughs> shit! <laughs> and put, put them in the trash. <laughs> A simple return them would have sufficed. My uncle started singing Silent Night very badly to try and ease the tension. <laughs> it didn't work. No shit, it didn't <laughs> Could I, I'm just gonna sing Silent Night slowly. And we'll Wait, just... you be grandpa. I'm grandma. Yeah. Really sell it. Yeah, let me get into character as grandpa. Yeah, not, not like you did last season, because that <sighs> grandpa was... Okay, it's gonna be the same as last season. Yeah. <laughs> I always say, yeah. Because <laughs> I'm old. All right, all right, you're already grandpa. Yeah. And I'm grandma. You know, I know how much, how hard you've worked this year, and I think you've, you've earned these. So I got us a couple. Yes! What is your gift for me? I, I, got, I got us a couple tickets to Alaska on a cruise. As a token of I pre did. <laughs> no, no. An Alaskan crew? What are you? Yeah, an Alaskan crew. <laughs> You've wasted your money! Oh. 10 out of 10. That's a 10 out of 10 story. Kicks ass. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. That's, That's too many spear! Oh, fucking sh! No, to be fair, no, 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 no. Before they could speak, so they're toddler probably. This is before they can even say, Papa, give me milk. <laughs> you know, my first words. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong store. Hey, look, I didn't know. Goddamn Shane keeps sucking on my nipples. <laughs> Ain't no milk gonna come out of that boy. <laughs> but it do feel all right. That didn't <laughs> The Furby, every once in a while, interjected screeches or growls. It took a while, but eventually we realized that when it did make noise, it was only to interrupt Becca. Eventually, the interruptions became so frequent that Becca got up and yelled at it. Shut up! Just shut up and leave me alone! There was a moment of stillness, and then, in a perfectly normal voice, the Furby responded. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Demonic garbling. What do you think that? What do you think that sounds like coming from a Furby? Probably sounds like this. <laughs> Did you get a fuck you in there? No. Oh. Oh god, dude. The mouth noises are so 
grotesque. This is the spirit cam. Everybody, everybody yeah. loves it. Here we go. Really give them a show on this one. The slaughter water. Give them a show. What do you mean by show? Yikes. Is that like a tongue show? <laughs> oh. Jesus Christ. Oh, oh. Hey, boys. <laughs> this happened when I was like nine years old. It was a couple days before Christmas, and my cousin and I were living in the living room having a sleepover. <laughs> It sounds like you constantly have to burp, which probably isn't that far off. We woke up around the same time to see a ghastly white specter in front of us. We didn't know what to make of it, and because he had just died months earlier. <laughs> Who? What? Assumed it was Michael Jackson. <laughs> Water, water, hear me, father, make this story even hotter. Oh! <laughs> oh shit, my drink fell. Fucking. Oh! What a pity. <laughs> oh my god. We actually have been blessed on this day. Have we? Yes, we have. This is from user. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> Sing it if you know it. Boobs. Oh my god. Are you 69? Are you for 20? I was wondering when Boob69420 was going to make a I reappearance. I can't believe that this was in the soggy pile. We've been blessed again. <laughs> father has blessed well, us. Father has day. blessed us. Oh, Father. Oh god, I can't wait to hear what Boobs has to say. Boobs is a person of few words. Yeah, brevity. My sibling informed me at Christmas that their room is being haunted by the ghost of a fox. Okay. <laughs> I'm not sure how they know it's a fox, but they have said it sleeps at the end of their bed with the kitten. I do hear noises down there at night, but my first thought wasn't ghost fox. What the, wait, wait, what the fuck's going happening right now? So there's a fox in the room. So here's the, the, a, big, the big points. Okay, you continue, continue. I'm not sure how they know it's a fox. They have said it sleeps at the end of their bed with the kitten. I do hear noises down there at night, but my first thought wasn't ghost fox. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> wait, wait, what? Another banger from our good pal, wait. Boobs. <laughs> wait, I read this 20. shit again, dude. Read it all you like. It's all there. It, the boob69420 has given you all the clues. They work in mysterious ways. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. I'm gonna be thinking about this as the lights go out of I, my eyes. <laughs> I'm gonna have to give that a 10 out of 10. It's too. a 10. Why did Boobs' sibling think it was a fox? Was it a ghost fox? On my deathbed, they're gonna be like, what are you, what are you trying to say, Grandpa? And I'll be like, what were you thinking, boobs? Ah. Speak up, Grandpa. Oh. <laughs> what? 69, 420. <laughs> it's gonna haunt me to the end of my days. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? Spent Christmas in the Alpine region of Germany, where Krampus is a popular character. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah, just don't. All right. On one night, people dress up as Krampus and run around the city in parades for their amusement and to scare kids. When my father and I walked home from the parade, I stopped to tie my shoe and my father turned around to me. Then I looked over his shoulder and saw a Krampus standing at the end of the alley. A Krampus? A Krampus! Wait, that makes it seem like they're a species, like a Bigfoot. Were you listening to the fucking story? I literally just said on one night, people dress up as Krampus. Yeah, but you said a Krampus as if it was like a normal, like an actual yes, Krampus. because this is an event where people dress up as Krampus. Yeah, but so I, you, mean, you said it in a way that was like an actual... I'm reading the story. I didn't say it like that. Well, you... Delivery left a lot to be desired. That's all I'm going to say. I stopped to tie my shoe and my father turned... He turned I stopped to turn my... I stopped to tie my shoe. My, you <laughs> my, my father turned in his pants. <laughs> you, you threw off my... Mojo. I stopped to tie my shoe. My father turned around to me. You adjusting your horn as you're trying to get it. I'm trying to tell a story about Krampus. Just listen to me. Because here's the thing. Don't point at me. Well, listen to me. 
<laughs> you don't have to listen to that intently. I was looking I didn't at think you. that would work. You got like hypnotized. You spellbound me. That was crazy. <laughs> listen to me. <laughs> I can't. I can't exercise Stop pointing this pointing at me. This well, you point creepy. at me. I can't. Listen I... to me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Mom and her boyfriend were coming out of the barn and getting in the car to drive home. I'm pretty sure this mom and the boyfriend were boning in that barn, by the way. I mean, it's a romantic setting. Your yeah. kids are in the car. <laughs> yeah, you know, with an earshot. Yeah, but the nice thing about a barn yeah. is that horses and stuff. I in was there. gonna say horses and cows. So you, you can know, always blame it on if them. If you got a moan, you just let out a moan <laughs> or, or a. <laughs> from Amira Hiddleston. One time I was playing Minecraft. Nice. <laughs> on the PS3. Fuck yeah. Throwback. And there's a mirror behind the TV. Wait, behind the TV? Behind the wait, TV. wait, what? <laughs> so weird. What kind of entertainment system they set up? That's bad. Are you trying to watch yourself play PS3? I don't know. That's sloppy. It's a like, weird. It's a weird I don't setup. Like that. I don't like that. Out of the corner of my eye, I see a little boy with a bowl cut. <laughs> <laughs> Hand striped shirt. The Hamburglar. He's got a hamburger in his apartment. <laughs> the lone jogger. <laughs> when I turn, he's gone. Our house is haunted by an old man. <laughs> wait, wait, what? So I was definitely spooked. And I told my dad. He didn't really believe me. This was weird because it happened less than eight years ago. And that kid was wearing some... It happened less than eight years ago. That kid was wearing some weird clothes. <laughs> another, <laughs> another time, <laughs> my brother got punched in the face <laughs> by an old ghost <laughs> because the old one <laughs> didn't like him. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> That's the end of the story. <laughs> Twenty has spoken, Dory. I'm sorry. I gotta take you back inside. Sorry, Dory. You gotta get out of here. Get it, get it, go. Come on, come on. Wait, that's right. Where'd I put my cards? Oh, they're right there. Jesus, man. Get it together. You get it together, dude. Boobs. <laughs> You can't just stop a sentence shout boobs into the night. <laughs> boobs! <laughs> boobs69420, who contributed a story last oh, night. Oh, An old friend of the show. There was that time I set fire to my hair on Christmas. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's scary. It was really long at the time, so I just ran to the bathroom, my hair ablaze, and stuck my head under the tap. Probably should have used the shower, it'd have been quicker, but my Wait, hair was on fire. how did she set her hair on fire? <laughs> my hair was on fire, so you understand my panic. Have you ever set your hair on fire? <laughs> That's the end of the story. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> there is zero explanation for how the hair caught on fire. Boob69420. What's going on in, in your household where your hair's catching on fire willy-nilly? A Christmas candle? Perhaps. And they lean over to say, Happy Christmas, Papa! I fooled my grandson again! <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Uh-oh, I got a fart. Wait, you or...? I do, I got a fart. Look, uh, it's episode four. <laughs> Just take off your lav, move it to the back of your chair. <laughs> I apologize. I'm sorry. I don't. I don't think I can do that. No, you have to. It's episode four. Right? It's the season no, finale. Wait, wait, wait. You know what? Because you. <laughs> no. No. I can't do it. No, I Ryan, you have to. I can't. I can't do it. Ryan, it's too so Do you want this to be a good season? It's not gonna fucking hinge on this. Okay. Well, it does hinge on this. Because I was expecting something, sort of a boom, you know? It sounded like someone stepped on a mouse. I finally realized where we were. My uncle is buried in that cemetery. Oh, and shit. as soon as I told her that, the whole car smelled like weed for like <laughs> two seconds. And then it was gone. Love, everyone's got an uncle who loves to blaze it, you know? What's, 
What's the deal? What's oh, the deal? Jesus <laughs> Christ. What are uncles anyway? <laughs> it's my dad's brother. It's my mom's brother. What are they doing there? I'm supposed to talk to them like they're sort of my dad? Except they're not my dad. <laughs> yes, now you yeah. get it. <laughs> no, don't. I don't. I was just playing along. Okay, all right. A nasty Na- man. Don't point. He's only going to get nasty. Don't point right? the camera with your little demon. Ryan, why don't you uh, give us a story? What the fuck just happened? <laughs> what would be the, the the worst song to have stuck at high volume, no matter what you did? My in least your car? favorite song in the world, Gautier. I knew it was gonna be that. Did you know somebody that? I used to know? Yeah, I, I knew it. that was the song. Hate it. Hate it. Kind of a banger. I'm not gonna lie. I don't like it. I don't know. Do, hey, do, sound do, off do, in the comments. Do, do you do, love do, that? Song? Do, do, do. <laughs> <laughs> when you do it like that, that's what it sounds like. Yeah, dude. sounds like Fraggle it sounds music. Sounds exactly like that. If For seven years, they played it relentlessly it. on the radio. I think Shane must have wrote that song and I stole it from him. If I wrote that song, I'd walk into the fucking ocean. Well, then I hope you fucking wrote that song. I didn't. I didn't. And uh, go fuck yourself. Hey, dude. <laughs> Rude. Maybe you'll be somebody I used to know. <laughs> <laughs> now that. Yeah, dude. Right out of ten spirits. Right too many spirits. Oh, yeah, dude. Uh, we're, we're going too many spirits on that story. Yeah, that would no. Too many spirits on. That oh, oh, cheers to that. Cheers dude. to that. Cheers, yeah, to, cheers that. to that. Cheers to that. Oh, <laughs> shit, dude. It's aggressive. <laughs> okay. Mm. I got so excited about the cheers, I forgot how shitty the drink was. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Did you just pick your nose? No. It's delicious. Yeah, it's really good. I like it. Uh, I'll give it a uh, uh, five out of ten. That's an F if you're one. Yeah, I got that. Uh, cool. Steven, I have a question for you. Yeah. You're our cocktail maestro. No. Yeah, you are. You're the cocktail no. maestro. Local, local neighborhood bartender. Local friendly neighborhood bartenders. You got any opinions on that? We kept hearing noises downstairs, but my family was out and I didn't have any pets. So eventually, we just kind of went downstairs and and, 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 and and one of the girls looked through the door and screamed, holy shit, it's a little girl. And we all screamed and ran. But then I remembered I had a little sister. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. When I was about to leave the kitchen, I saw a weird shadow in the shape of a person. I assumed it was either my own shadow uh-huh. <laughs> or a shadow from a chair or something. Yeah. Does this person look like a chair? Is that me or a chair? Is that me or a chair? That Sometimes it's hard to tell. How's it going, America? Welcome back to our favorite game show, Me, me or, or a chair. chair! And this is a game show where, of course, I point out a picture and you tell me if it's me or a chair. I hate Ouija boards so much. It went on for a while doing figure eights and talking about random things. We asked why it wasn't working and it spelled out a single word perfectly, which it hadn't done before. N-A-K-E-D, naked. Oh, like the demon is naked? No, I think the demon wanted to see them naked. What a fucking pervert, dude. Pervert demon, pervert, pervert. This is in middle school. This This demon should be sent to hell. Oh, wait, should it be sent to heaven? Do I make you horny, baby? You look like a nightmarish Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> Tell you what, I'm gonna have my cherry now. We're gonna all watch this, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I could've gone without the tongue. Mm, that's good. It's good from at Big Scary Fucking Owls. <laughs> Okay, off to a good start. This is a 10 out of 10 story. I rate it 10 out of 10. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> when my parents moved into our current house about 30 years ago, they found a box of human ashes in the basement. That's scary as fuck. My dad called the family and was like, hey, <laughs> do you want your relative back? And they said, no, you can keep him. We usually just have the box on our enclosed porch that nobody uses, but we always bring them out for the holidays and put the dude on the mantle. The dude! (laughs) What the fuck? You know what? I said 10 out of 10. I stand by it as a 10 out of 10 story. 10 out of 10. Clear Stephen Lim at 3 a.m. Okay, let's see it. Oh! That's interesting. Oh, no, no. What's he saying? What's he saying? Woo! I'm Big Apple Stevie. I own this town. I've lived here for two and a half months. <laughs> Can you put it on? Because my hands don't work. No. What? Figure it out. 
Wait. This is a show where we drink our drinks and review your ghost stories. I just realized I was looking at the wrong camera. You stupid piece of sh Uh, do, uh, Ryan Bergara. Yeah, I'm just gonna do me. Wait, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Can you just fucking go full unsolved? I can do that. We haven't even done it this entire That's series. That's crazy. We haven't done it. Once when I was young, we were cooking some hot dogs for dinner. I can't believe this is the final story of the season. Just cooking hot dogs? My dad was outside and yelled, quote, get out here, end quote. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> We all went outside and left the hot dogs boiling. Yeah. When we came back, in the house, all the hot dogs were gone. What? Wait, Wait what? <laughs> Where'd they go? We had no pets that would have eaten them. Yeah? Hot dog ghost. <laughs> <laughs> Ghost. <laughs> ghost. I can't believe that's the final story of the season. <laughs> Hot dog ghost. I want that every. I want. I want every. I want everyone to know that we are drinking responsibly. We're drinking very responsibly, which is why Stephen Lim mixed rum with tequila. Yeah, it's a very safe mixture. <laughs> You said don't it! you fucking point at me. You said it! You don't point at I me. I will point at no, you, you, you don't son point of a at bitch! Me. Not in Sorry, Linda. Respect to Linda. Okay, put your, put your finger back up and retract it. Do it like this. It's done. Sorry I called you a son of a bitch. Your mother's a lovely woman. Thank you. I, last episode, I just well, I went on a tirade about not calling mothers bitches. I know. And here, episode two, Linda Pergare is a bitch, is what, what? I'm going <laughs> That's basically what I said. You and did, I feel bad about you it. You say that. That's She's true. the loveliest lady. Wait a second. We, we need, we need to feed this fire, dude. Let's review the drink first. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> just, just dance around this with me. I could do that. I, yes! I really hope this flame doesn't ignite my balls. That would be bad. It'd be funny. It'd be good for internet content, but bad for my future children. I'm assuming we're gonna go to a fade out soon. Oh, that fire sure is getting bigger and really close to the package. It feels good on the thigh. It does feel good on the inner thighs. Oh, until oh, it doesn't, oh, if you know oh, what I mean. Oh, oh. oh yeah. Thanks for watching. You're free to go now. Bye. -bye.